another grocery haul. I love how when we do these hauls, like you totally learn, you, all of a sudden you know karate. Oh, I've always known karate. <laughs> Boom. Oh, whoa. <laughs> Is that the Karate Kid? Or was that Bruce Lee? Who is this? Who oh, did this? I don't know. Tina Phillips! Wow. That's a thing though. Someone did you that. You did do that when we first met. I said, Danny, come <laughs> here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. So today, we went to Walmart. Well, actually, not really, kind of. What we did, what I did, was order the groceries online, go over to Walmart, park, and then they put it all in my car, loaded it up, and I brought it home. And now I'm here showing you guys everything we got. A lot of this shopping was mainly for like ingredients we needed for dinners coming up this week because I have been horrible at making dinners during the summer. You just don't want to cook in the mm. summer. At least I just don't. It's not my favorite, but. Sometimes it's so hot out here, you just don't want to eat. I know, you don't want to eat, you don't want to cook, you're just kind of like, ugh. All right, first up, you guys, we are starting with the bagel bites. After I said I'm gonna cook, now I'm showing you the frozen meals that the kids will eat during the day. So, bagel bites it is. We got two boxes of those, which we love. I also got some Greek yogurt, key lime. This is a hint. Do you and Ethan really like that, or no, just you? No, but this is for a recipe coming up. Oh, a cook ooh, with me recipe ooh. coming up. I Comment, needed this yogurt, so. Comment down below if you guys have an idea as to what we're using this for in a dessert. I recipe. think you'll get a better idea of what it's gonna be as we go because I got all the ingredients for it in here. So the other one is Cool Whip. Ooh. So grabbed a thing of Cool Whip, got some strawberries, bam. Two things of strawberries. Now you guys know when other people shop for you, the biggest thing is how did they do with the produce? Ooh, how do you think they did? It's, okay. not, it's not looking too bad. Bad. Okay. Not too bad so far. So, hey, I'll take it. So there's those. Now I'm wondering though, they get us our cucumbers. Wow. I ordered six cucumbers. Oh. Damn. Well, you know what? I'm not too disappointed about that because the I last am. time we went to Walmart, they weren't their that great. cucumbers were so soggy. No. It was literally what? like having a green hot dog. Good thing I went to Vaughn's the other day and grabbed some cucumbers, but we're gonna need more. So, wait, what'd you say? They were like a burnt, what? A green hot dog? You don't even listen. You're supposed to be even listening to what you were saying. I said that. I just heard a bunch of laughs in the background. I'm like, did dad say something funny? Uh, yeah. No, I just said the Walmart cucumbers are like green hot dogs. Oh, they were pretty gross last yeah, time. They're yeah, they're like soft. You squeeze their, oh, this is not a cucumber. Yeah, those were not fun. So, dang it though. No loss there. Well, we might have to call them and say, refund please. Well, I'm sure they didn't charge us for it. No, they did. I, sh I looked at the receipt and oh, everything wow. they didn't have, they didn't charge us for. Wow. Yeah, so boom, asparagus. I got two things of asparagus. These actually look pretty decent though too. Yeah. So, two things of those. Then I also got some heavy whipping cream, which is for colored pasta this week. Uh, the tortellini pasta, which we already have in the fridge, but we needed heavy whipping cream for that. Got some cream cheese for my uh, mini peppers. Okay. Mmm, so good. Mini peppers, cream cheese, and lemon pepper. So good. so good. Cottage cheese, do you know what this is for? Taste test. Ooh. Ooh. Comment down below, you guys, what are your cottage cheese combo nations? As you might have already guessed, we are gonna be doing a cottage cheese combinations taste test. Yeah, so what do you eat with your cottage cheese? I know a lot of people eat uh, pineapple, pineapple, peaches, uh, salt. I do salt and pepper. What else? Chips. There's so many different things, you guys. Oh, Let yeah. us know. Comment down below. <laughs> what? That's Daddy's face. Okay, comment down below what you eat yours with, and we will try it out in our taste test. So there's that. Then we've got the pizza rolls, which are already opened. Ooh, so, so gross. Those are gross. Yeah, I don't love these, but the kids do. So there you go. We got some pizza rolls. Then we got some um, green leaf lettuce, which you guys, I'm not impressed. I love the green leaf lettuce at Vons. This is not looking too good. Yeah, and we're waiting for our lettuce yeah. to grow over in our little garden over there. Yeah, it's taking a minute. So we got those, and then I grabbed some Caesar salad, boom, because these always just make a really good side for any meal that we're having. So, and I think we're actually having, oh, I should have got more cottage cheese. 
Oh, wow. Oh, I always for forget lasagna? something. Yeah. Just use did. it for the lasagna. We'll go get it for the I'm going to need more than that, though. So I'll have to go to the store anyways. But that's all right. Always, you guys, always miss something. Uh. I know. So anyways, two bags of the Caesar salad. Then we got two bags of the Parmesan cheese. Yummo. We got three bags of the mozzarella cheese because... I use a lot of this for the lasagna. Okay, then we got the beef and bean burritos. Monterrey, those Mon are pretty good. These are decent. Yeah. They're decent, so got some of those, eight pack family size. Comment down below if you guys save your Taco Bell mild sauces. Oh, for this stuff. And then put it on these burritos, it's so good. It's actually smart to save them anyway because they always give you a handful of those sauces. We, like, what am I doing? What, what am I growing, doing growing up, we had a drawer in the fridge full, full of Taco Bell sauces. Oh, dang. Yeah. I think it's smart. Just keep them on hand, always have them. Okay, we got some broccoli because Danny has requested chicken and broccoli once again this week, which yes. Considering it was such a big hit with everybody this last Father's Day. Yes. Um, I was like, yeah, let's make it again. The only problem is, you guys, our house stunk all night. Uh, I hate yeah. the smell of cooked broccoli That's in your true. house. Well, the but, other reason you were like, oh, it stinks in our room. It's all in our room. Someone ate my beef jerky oh they opened and it and left it open in our room. Oh. So that's what it was. Broccoli, beef jerky, not a good combo. And I think it might have been Elijah. I didn't open it in your Someone room. opened my beef jerky. I never opened it. Someone okay. opened no, it. I have to explain this, okay? <laughs> okay, yeah. come explain. So everyone's gonna think I opened it in the room. I actually didn't. It was opened <laughs> on the, this island right here. And then I said, Dad, can I have the beef jerky? He said, yes. And I brought it upstairs in my room. I no, was, but some before that, before that. someone before that? opened it first. Who, Ashley. Oh, busted. And then they put it in our room. I didn't put it in my room. It was on that counter, and then I saw it there, and then it was gone. Guess how much beef jerky I had. You <laughs> said, hey, you, you, hey you said, you said. Don't pull that card on us. Like, oh, I'm not really that big of a fan of jerky, so. Oh, yeah, now man. you're going to cry, save me. <laughs> Oh, so anyways, glad we we solved that family <laughs> dispute. You guys, we also got some pulled rotisserie chicken because it was a substitute because they didn't have the actual rotisserie. Wow. And because they didn't have it, they also gave us shredded rotisserie seasoned fully cooked pork. Okay. This actually looks really good. So it's like a bonus thing? Yeah. Because cool. they didn't have the actual chicken, they gave us That's two of cool. these things. Make so. that in a sandwich. Heck yeah, make it in a sandwich <laughs> or whatever. We also, um, Tina's also going to be making another recipe, hopefully, um, that my mom made that I grew up with. Did you get that other one or no? <laughs> oh man, she says, what? Yes, I did. <clears throat> oh, we already did a cook with me on that. I know, I just wanted it. Oh! <laughs> You're like, what, what, do you want any meals this week? And I was like, you yeah, the I chicken was like, broccoli and then I was like, oh, things. albondiga soup with, I got um, distracted <sighs> with the chicken and broccoli. Wow. And then I was like, oh, with cooked carrots and I celery. can get the, I'll get the stuff for it. Cause oh, I got to go get cottage cheese anyway. So I'll grab the stuff for that's, it. That's totally that's fine. That's delicious that's too. Totally fine. It's yeah. fine. It's whatever. Cause I love the albond albondiga soup. I was telling Tina, I'm like, I, it, maybe I'm missing my mom because I, I know all he's like requesting food. all these home cooked <laughs> meals. And I'm like, okay, we need to go see grandma Blanca. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next up guys. We got some of the twin popsicles, which Ooh. have already been open as well. Actually, can I have one of those? Oh my. Red. Yes, Danny, you can eat and relax back there. Okay, so there's those. And then, you guys, I love these. I saw these and I was like, you know what? I'm feeling it. So I got them. Creamies. Ooh, whoa. Banana. They're so good. Huh. And it's been forever since I've had them. 120 <laughs> calories. Well, who cares? 14 grams of sugar. I don't know. They, it sounds good to me. I was just wondering because I have ice cream a lot. So I'm like, I wonder if this would give me my ice cream fix and not be as like Can you crazy. Um, dip it in chocolate? That'd be awesome. Ugh, probably, but I don't want to. Banana just sounds Ooh, perfect. You don't like chocolate covered bananas with nuts? Not really. So good. Not really a fan of that. Then I also got just some hamburger meat just to have for whatever, tacos, you goulash, can make some meatballs. all of that stuff. Oh yeah, meatballs. And so in the albondiga <laughs> soup, you've got to make the meatballs from scratch. Yeah. And, and my mom would put rice in the meatballs. So good. 
Yeah, we have a cook with me on it, so I got to go back and watch it so I know. Those cook with me's come in handy, you guys, because mm -hmm. I go back and watch things all the time. So, okay, then we got some bananas. Uh, five of them. That's they had to switch weird. these ones out because they didn't have the others. Oh, okay. So, anyways, that's a substitute. Then we got Danny's party pack. So we got <laughs> the Cheetos. We got the Doritos. And we got the pretzels. Yes. Danny wanted to make his own... Check. Munchies. Munchies. Munchies mix. So he's like, just get all the big bags and then I'll just put it together. And I'm like, all right. Because I always good. go and get a bag of munchies yeah. for like two bucks. It's like, just get the big bags. And I'll just make my own. Make your and own. half the time I buy the bags, they're full of pretzels. Yeah. So here I could just put a few pretzels and... Just uh, however many you want. Yes. That's true. Okay, so we got that. And then the other chips we got were the Hint of Lime. Elijah requested these. So I thought, you know what? I'll make some of my guacamole this week. And oh, they can dip it in that. That's the only time I eat those chips. Is with the guac? Yes. Those are like some of my favorite chips. Yeah. I love Takis and that's just Takis without the spice. So Ooh. I mean, they're, it's, it's they're so good. Ooh, they I'll are. buy like 10 more bags of those if that means you guys don't eat those Takis Oh anymore. no, I'm still eating Takis. Oh. <laughs> Takis are still better than this, but this is a close second. Yeah, these are really good. Actually, not really a close second, just a second. Actually, stay tuned because Ethan and Elijah <laughs> did a Takis taste test. Oh, they did. Really good. Coming up. With some different Taki type <laughs> things, so. Okay, then we also got the goldfish which I specifically ordered the flavor blasted goldfish oh. and they didn't grab them. I don't, I'm curious how long those are gonna last in this house. Meaning like, are they gonna stay? They might last a little while only because they're not the flavor mm -hmm. blasted. I don't know, we'll see. Hopefully, I'm sure we'll, one of us will eat them. Okay, and then I got two graham cracker crust uh, pie things. Wonder what that's for. That might be something coming up. I don't know. And then I got lasagna noodles to make lasagna. Mm, I love your lasagna. Oh, it actually sounds so good right now. Mm. Like, I kind of want it right now. Okay, then we got the strawberry lemonade Minute Maid. Ooh, okay. Ethan requested this, so I was like, you know what? I'll grab some. They like to make their ices with this. So they'll pour it in a cup, put it in the freezer, let it freeze, and then eat it up. And I grew up in my fridge, my mom would always get the big fruit punch one. Yeah. And that one was so good. That one works too. Yes. <laughs> okay, and then I also got some lime flavored jello. I wonder what that's for. I don't know. Okay, and then I got the elbows, macaroni, just to have some pasta on hand. I got four boxes of those. Oh, wow. We got goulash this week that we're gonna be making. So speaking of goulash, I needed beef broth for that. So I got four of these beef broths because we have been out for a little while. So I needed to stock back up on those. And then now I'm kind of feeling bad because I just realized. They've got the green hot dogs. They got, but these are good. Oh really? Yeah, these are good. These are not soggy at all, but they did only legit. get four instead of six. Okay. Unless it's in a different bag, which those is not. Those definitely so. look better than those English ones. Yeah, so there's those. And then I also got some Honeycrisp apples in the bag. I think Ooh. it comes with like one, two, three, six. Comes with six. So there's those. And then they did also get us our avocados. They're not ripe yet. Uh oh, too hard? Yeah, they're too hard, so I'll have to wait to make the guacamole, I think. Actually, I think we have some in the fridge I can make the guacamole with, but. And Tina has a way of checking them. Checking the. Don't you like pull off like the little. Yeah, but now I just fill them mm. because I found that doing it that, like there was this thing going around all the time where if you go like this and take the little stem off. <laughs> oh, okay, so you take this off and they say if it's bright green like that, that it's, it's good. Oh. But to me, like these aren't, these are not right oh. at all. So wow. I guess it just depends if you want one that's like, you're gonna wait to use, then these are good to get. Okay. So now I just kind of go by fill. I don't really look at it like that anymore. So anyways, there's those. And then I got three loaves of the Grandma Sycamore bread, Ooh. just to have on hand if I want to do like grilled cheese this week or you know, whatever. I had two sandwiches, sandwiches today. I know. So. Grab some more bread for that. And then, is that everything? I also got, I also got the toilet wand refills mm. because we needed them. So grab that. And then I got a thing of water that's still in the car, shocker. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, so, 
That's everything. Wow. Okay. That's, yeah. Literally yeah. everything we got. And all of this, you guys, was under $200. With what? What was it? $195. Okay. That's Actually, $192 with after the substitutions and stuff. I think it was $192. Sweet. So, not bad. Considering, like, I have stuff, all the ingredients and stuff that I need for meals this week. And we, Plus snacks. And we are still going to be going to Trader Joe's, you guys. Yes, so, that's coming. Yeah, since they don't deliver, we actually get to do a normal grocery haul where we get to go inside like we do, used to do, do in the do, past. Do. Yeah, it's just been so hot, you guys. You literally mm -hmm. don't even want to leave your house in this weather. It's well, crazy. Because by the time you get in the car, drive over there, the air conditioner just gets kicking. And then all of a sudden you turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> you're like, oh, you're yeah. a sweaty mess by the time oh. it's all said and done. Yes. <laughs> so, anyways, this was a nice alternative. It was good just to be able to get in the car, have them load it, and then drive it back. Especially with running back and forth with picking up Ashlyn from work and all the things. So, just worked out. Very convenient. Love it. And that's everything we got. So, that, that's it, you guys. That's it, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and don't forget. Choose your day.